hello guys so welcome back to my channel um as you can see i'm relaxing baby sleeping so it's the perfect time for me to just you know relax for a bit and also my husband is at work so what else can i ask me time you know i'm joking um so yeah uh, so when i'm trying to relax i make my coffee and also i put the humidifier on um as as you saw earlier and um, i love the smell of it and uh, it just gives me just gives a relaxing you know vibe and mood and yeah today we are two months old yeah my baby is two months old and i'm two months postpartum so i just wanted to update you on how we're doing how we are and all that so we are doing pretty good baby is growing she's growing we went to the doctor yesterday and um yeah she gained she's now four kilos and 800 grams which is um a little bit above average so she's growing a bit more than average which is good very good and there's no concerns with her i'm just happy about it um she's doing fine and breastfeeding got much much better now like i used to feel pain and now i don't feel almost any pain it's just and actually when you know when at times my breast feels so you know it's so engorged so i i feel like i really need to you know get the milk out and it's actually a relief when i give the milk to my baby when when i breastfeed and when this milk comes out whoo it's such a relief so yeah we are doing good um i'm giving her a bit of formula as well maybe twice a day not not too much so my husband can help with feeding as well which he does and um she's taking the formula as well with no issues thank god in that department she's not fussy she loves her food trust me someone is you know she took that for me i think you know anyway um I hope she carries on eating like that and when she grows I hope she's not a fussy eater and I hope she's gonna be eating everything otherwise we're gonna have a problem but anyway um, so yeah as I was saying we are doing well do, we are doing good the only thing is still her night uh, well her, her sleep in general even during the day at times she's so restless she does not sleep during the day at all and it's very difficult for me those days are very challenging for me and at times she cries a lot as well and that is even more distressing to me and of course for her so that's another thing but apart from that and her sleep also sometimes her night sleep is not great sometimes it's still not regulated at time but there was one time that she slept for like five hours and i and i thought to myself oh my god that said we are getting there this is how it's gonna be now she's gonna be sleeping more throughout the night but no the next day it was back to you know it was back to her waking up every one and a half hours two and a half hours and then she wouldn't go back to sleep immediately and yeah it, it still gets tough at times throughout the night as well that's the only thing i'm very looking forward to you know i want that to change so much i want to get my sleep but what can i do that's 
that's new bonds for you so that's that um I'll, i just want to start looking for um uh, exercises that is uh cesarean kind of friendly exercises so i can start with my so i can start working out because i have something coming in may something big and i want to be in the best shape as possible and i just want to show you how my body looks at two months postpartum I did not gain much weight anyway throughout my pregnancy and it was mostly on my tummy area but the rest I think is kind of the same so yeah that's me at two months postpartum and yeah it's just me especially that I need to work on I still feel kind of numb in this area because of the c-section still needs to heal complete completely the scar is here which is healing very well and I'm just just need this area the numbness that I feel to go away but I don't know how long that can take just want to show you a little bit my tummy so that's my tummy now and you see the line that I got from pregnancy is going as well so on I just need to work on that and that's the only stretch marks as you can see that's the stretch marks I got from pregnancy and and yeah in general I'm happy with my progress and yeah but I just wanted to say that get me getting back into my um, into the body I used to have before I got pregnant is it's, it's not just it's not as if I'm forcing myself to do that because I have to I have to get back to it I just I'm just doing it for myself first first of all of course for my husband as well because I always want to look hot and sexy for him I don't want to let myself go but I am definitely doing it for me and um, I know some mothers they always say oh I don't have time to exercise and this and that trust me mothers we need to find time for ourselves like I know it might, it might look like an like extra work like working out is adding to your daily tasks that you have to, to do but trust me um, exercising is gonna help you mentally as well to feel more like more motivated stronger like you know happier and all that and this is why i'm doing it i genuinely feel happy and and all these positive feelings when i'm in shape and when i'm looking after my body you know and my skin and everything it's it's me it's it's, it's my choice it's something personal for me it's so important and i'm so looking forward to getting back into exercise and and putting on my cute clothes and my my cute outfits i'm looking forward for my holidays in summer because i'm going to cyprus for sure and i need to look cute i'm gonna take my baby and my husband we all going to cyprus in summer and uh, I'm just so excited for that and I want to look my best ladies we gotta find some time for ourselves and even if you don't find time to exercise take your baby out for a walk you know with the push chair I do that I do that because every day in the house I can't when I see the Sun who 
I I just want to be out there I take my baby I put her on the push chair and I just take her for a walk I grab a coffee you know and and that's another relaxing moment for me and and it's nice so there's there's there is things that we can do to to just take care of ourselves and and that's why I love fashion I love fashion because you know it boosts your confidence so even if you don't have time to exercise wear some nice clothes even in the house even in the house and just look yourself in the mirror and and have your moment and tell yourself that you're pretty and all that if no one is telling you that you're pretty say that to yourself you know we don't have to expect from others to tell us we can tell ourselves that we are pretty and beautiful and all that so yeah I'm out of topic now and um, yeah let me see how my baby is doing she's been asleep for, for three and a half hours she can't oop <laughs> my baby <laughs> So cute, baby. So cute. Hmm? You're my cutie pie. My cutie pie. Look how big she is now. Thank you guys for watching. And that was. <laughs> that was an update of two months postpartum. Hopefully, I'll see you guys very, very soon. Yeah, I just forgot to say to um, subscribe to my channel, like this video, share it, and yeah, let me know. If there is anything else you would like to see and um, leave your comments down below I love to engage with you guys and uh, I'll see you in the next video bye for now now you happy are you happy now are you happy now are you happy now are you happy are you happy you happy now yeah. Yeah.